this will be served with public opinion forces Prosser to resign. I do represent the Women's Medical Fund charity that has paid for abortion care for nearly 20,000 women without care. Prosser is one of the anti-abortion justices on the state Supreme Court whose anti-feminist positions imperil women and our rights. This behind us is supposed to be a, a temple of justice, not a butcher shop. We in the Madison chapter of the National Lawyers Guild are absolutely outraged that this man is still on the bench, still on the bench, without having been put on administrative leave pending investigation of this act. I don't know how many times I've represented people in these circumstances, and this is not a radical proposal to take someone who has admittedly been involved in an act of workplace violence against a woman on administrative leave pending the outcome of the investigation. An employer, an employer has a legal obligation to provide a workplace free of hazards. And so this obligation, this obligation extends to the employer of Justice David Prosser, and if I'm not mistaken, I believe that we are the employer of Justice David Prosser. How can any woman expect justice at the hands of a court in which a woman chief justice may be publicly labeled not only a bitch, but a total bitch by a male colleague? And when I'm in the audience at a rally, I just wait to chant, so I have a couple of chances to suggest. Prosser cute Prosser. You want to try it out? Prosser Q. Prosser. Prosser Q. Prosser. The alleged physical assault by Justice Prosser is completely unacceptable. He must. Justice Prosser should step down while the investigation continues. Thank you. Now, this is classic workplace bullying. Remember what was going on at the time of his attack on Justice Bradley. He and his three conservatives were trying to muscle through in record time in violation of all current standard operating procedures for the Supreme Court a decision to uphold to uphold what the conservative Republican legislators wanted them to do. And when Justice Bradley questioned what they were going to do, he wasn't going to tolerate it. This is classic workplace bullying. And it's got to stop. And there is one simple message, and you are all here today for this, and there are people across Wisconsin who are joining this, and they are saying clearly, unmistakably, Prosser must go.